Hey folks, so I want to take a few minutes and talk to you guys a little bit about uh, tokens and markers that I use within uh, 40k to kind of help me remember uh, a lot of the different actions that my various different units have uh, taken. Um, now, X-Wing is a good example of a game where you need a lot of tokens to remind you of different things, and 40k, for, for whatever reason, has been starting to turn into that with me, so I've been using uh, various different uh, little tokens and trinkets here and there to remind me uh, of certain things. So I've got some acrylic ones here. Uh, the small little snowflakes usually represent hull points or wounds. The large ones usually represent jink. These coins, I've uh, used them for my Dark Eldar in the past as uh, tokens to remind me about Jink, but uh, recently I've been running Yanari, so I need another token to remind me about Soul Burst. So with that said, uh, I've got on order from Redneck Basement Industries some flame tokens, so I've got Fire Nice kind of going on theme. These ones here are my objective markers, so I've got my standard Eldar ones and my team uh, objective markers. So all of them have numbers, 1 to 6, and uh, so I'll usually use my blue ones if I'm just uh, screwing around, uh, or I'll use my uh, wooden ones at uh, the, the team tournament. I also made um, some psychic cards. Now, you usually get a decent, just one set of psychic cards in a pack, and uh, I usually need more than one. So uh, <laughs> um, what I did uh, to kind of help me remember uh, which psychic uh, powers belong to who I've also colored them too to kind of help out a little bit uh, haven't used those yet I'm going to try it out see how they go um, so yeah these are basically um, my solution to my bad memory <laughs> So uh, what I'd like to hear is uh, what uh, do you guys do to uh, help you remember about uh, hull points and wounds? You guys used to use dice. Uh, how do you remember if a vehicle has run or has gone to ground or um, if uh, a, a vehicle is uh, immobilized or something? So with that said, I look forward to hearing from you guys and I'll talk to you later. Bye now.